College football has long been one of America's great pastimes. It's got big plays, electric fans, and pageantry. You can't forget about the pageantry. The first flyover came more than 100 years ago. And over time, they've become a celebrated pregame ritual. Ahead of Penn State's game against Ohio State on Saturday, a pair of HC-130s carried a trio of Nittany Lions high above Beaver Stadium. Do you always see pictures of it and like you're in the stadium, um, but seeing it flying overhead was really neat. Colonel Jim Tuthill and Lieutenants Jane Lee and Alexandra Maldonado were a part of the 415th Squadron out of Kirkland Air Force Base in New Mexico. I'm Jane Lee, class of 2019. I'm Alexandra Maldonado, oh, class of 2020. We are Penn State. <laughs> Lieutenant Lee, a Belfont native, grew up in Happy Valley, but it took coming to Penn State to become a football fan. Freshman year, everyone was like, oh, you have to get like student tickets. So I was like, of course. While Lieutenant Maldonado grew up like many, leading blue and white. My mother used to always stuff me in little cheerleader outfits, and I hated it because that's just not my personality. How quickly did you say yes when they asked if you wanted to be this way over? Immediately. Just 100% immediately. <laughs> Thursday, ahead of the game, the crew took a practice run across the skies of State College. Perfect flyover boils down to one thing, perfect timing. We just know that from our six miles inbound is going to take, at our certain airspeed, is going to take a minute and a half, let's say. Um, so we know that once the national anthem starts, we need to be headed from six miles inbound, pointed towards the stadium, so to, to, to time it correctly. On Saturday, the crew began its routine around 9 a.m., hitting the skies around 11, as the final notes, the national anthem rang, a familiar rumble grew as the planes roared over the field. For this team, it was mission accomplished. Being part of that game event, I've never been, um, you know, a part of anything other than just being a spectator. So that's going to be the best is, is to just have that memory of being part of the game. Honestly, just to be back at a game, I think. Um, the flyover is really cool. I'm very excited. But just to be back where the energy is really neat and like, it's almost like being back at home. Reporting for your Nittany Nation, I'm Andrew Clay.